everybody welcome back to my channel happy thursday i feel really good because let me tell you i had a stats quiz yesterday i was super stressed i but i took the quiz i feel okay about it which is really nice and i had work from 6 to 11 p.m last night so i got home late went to bed at one or so it is i don't know what time it's like 10 something so I slept in, which was nice. One of my classes got canceled, which makes me so happy. I mean, I was gonna go anyways, but it's nice that now I have the morning free. I'm gonna work out right now and then go to my class at 12.30. My nails, I got them done yesterday. They're really cute and they match my workout top today. That was intentional. But yeah, I'm really excited for spring break. I still have quite a few things to do before then, but I leave tomorrow night and I can't wait. I think I forgot to say this, but great things are gonna happen today. Just got home from my workout. I didn't film any of it because I was trying to go quick. And I feel like, I don't know, do you guys like seeing my workouts? Let me know down below. I know some of you want me to do a more in-depth workout routine, which I will do hopefully soon. I'm waiting for the water to get warm. And I have class in about 30 minutes, so I need to hurry up. I'm gonna make something really quick to eat for breakfast. Then I'm gonna try to catch the bus so I make it on time. I'm all showered. I've got my favorite. This is my favorite shirt ever from Life is Good. And I've had it since I was in 11th grade. It's like an extra large. It is my favorite shirt. Shout out to the shirt. I'm wearing shorts today because it's kind of sunny outside. I don't know. Um, the bus is coming in seven minutes. So I need to leave pretty soon because I still have to walk there. Whew. I made a PB&J for myself really quickly. I made an appointment to get a haircut next Saturday back in San Diego and I'm really excited because my hair is so long right now. It's like at my butt, actually past my butt almost. And so it needs to be cut because there is no reason for me to have hair this long. Running a few minutes late, but not too bad. Probably like five minutes. I just got out of class. We are gonna get boba now. The sun is out, I feel so good. It was really rainy yesterday, but today is a good day. I forgot my glasses, so I could barely see in lecture, which is really rough. Wish I had remembered. But I also got the goods, my boba. This is the Bomberman from Yucha, if you're ever in the area. Super, super good. Back home with my bomber man i actually have an appointment at 3 30 a skype call with my study abroad a study abroad representative to talk about the internships that i'm interested in for when i go to australia this summer but it is 2 22 right now and i wanted to talk to you guys about basically my schedule I want to kind of break down my schedule with all of you and tell you what I am doing because when I think about what I have to do every week, I can't believe it. I literally, thinking about it, don't have a day where I can just go to the mall or go to San Francisco for the whole day and spend a day there. I don't have time to do outings like that for a long period of time, which kind of sucks. And also I feel like I'm bettering my future, so I don't mind it right now, I guess. I'm taking 18 units this semester, which is the most I've ever taken. I've told you this before. The courses are not like the hardest classes I've ever taken. I'm taking stats, polyecon, global studies, environmental earth sciences, political science class, and then my internship, I was able to get two units for that. I go to my internship two times a week and I spend three hours each session there, so six hours, and then 
when I'm not there, I'm usually working remotely. So I spend one to two hours working remotely. I do marketing and outreach for my internship. So that takes up a good chunk of my time every week. I also work 18 hours per week at my job because your girl needs money. I have a certain lifestyle that I like to live, thus I need money. <laughs> and I am saving up for a study abroad in Australia. That's gonna be freaking expensive. I'm not gonna work for two months. So I'm doing my best to save, but I sometimes get home from work at 11 p.m. On Saturday, I work from 11.45 to 8 p.m. That's a little over eight hours. I do have a lunch break, one lunch break, but like that is a long work day. Saturday, nope, don't have much time to like relax or do something fun, which you know, it's whatever, it's what I choose. I am the president of Cal Hawaii Club. We practice two times a week for two hours, so that's four hours, and then we have an hour of meeting, officer meeting every week, so that's five hours, and then I always have to do stuff outside of practice and meetings, and I have to make sure we're running right internally, and there's a ton of stuff that needs to be done, and our luau is in April. We're gonna have extra practices during the week, so that's gonna be even more time. There's gonna be a ton of stuff I'm gonna have to do on my own time, and that is really concerning to think about because it's a lot to put together a luau. It's a huge event and there's about 300 people there. There's dinner, it's a big production and uh, <laughs> I'm so excited but I'm also so nervous and a little bit stressed out when I think about it because it's just so much work. Oh, and then the last thing that I kind of do for me is I work out four to five times a week consistently. I don't think I ever really work out less than that unless I am doing like midterms and I really need to study and stuff. But yeah, I'm pretty consistent with my fitness. And so all in all, that is a ton of stuff to be doing all at once. And I'm not gonna say that you should and I'm not gonna say that like this is the way to live your life. This is just the way I'm currently living my life. <laughs> I'm exhausted, but all of it is so rewarding. And so, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys, like, the whole rundown of my schedule. I post only once a week right now because it does take one to two hours to edit and stuff. And then I have to film. And sometimes I'm just doing too much. So it kind of sucks that I don't upload as often. But I feel like right now I just can't commit to posting more than once a week. Sometimes I do. I'm aiming to post an extra video every other week. But there's no promises on that. So like it's a lot and I just want to update you guys on what I've been up to. I feel good. I feel tired but I feel good and I feel that my work is meaningful. So that makes me happy. Mm. So good. Anyway, I'm going to relax for like 30 minutes and then see it's 2.30. So maybe at 3 I'm going to start cleaning my desk area and then I have to hop on my Skype call at 3 30 and then after that I need to pack because I'm leaving tomorrow night to go back home Is definitely yeah yeah okay and where where do you think that you'd rank that amongst the other preferences I would probably make that third choice third? yeah I really like the AI aspect of it. Just finished my Skype call with the woman from Sydney and I'm really excited. There's several like events planned. It's gonna be pretty intensive from what she's talked to me about. Now, my room is kind of a mess. So, got my luggage. I use this luggage every time I go somewhere. Okay. So I've got pants here, one, two, three, four, and then whatever pants I wear tomorrow. I've got workout shorts and then a workout pair of leggings, and those are the only workout bottoms I'm going to bring because I have a lot at home. Got bras, underwear, these are the sports bras I'm bringing. They're literally all the Lululemon Free to Be Wild bras because those are my absolute favorite bought this new bikini. It is so cute. I really want the matching top, but she doesn't have any at the moment. It is from Navahine Lole Swimwear. 
really adorable. And then I got this one, which I was thinking of returning just because I don't absolutely love it. It's from Disruptive Youth. But then I read a bunch of stuff saying that people didn't get their money back, so I'd rather just keep it than possibly lose my money. <laughs> I've got this really adorable set that I'm pretty sure you guys have seen before if you watch my vlogs. I'm bringing this dress that is new and I want to wear it. Maybe we'll go on a night out. I have no idea. I've got a couple tops here. I'm not bringing any jackets because I have jackets at home. I've also got these two. They're sleeveless. Just this pink one and a mustard yellow one. That's pretty much all the clothes that I'm going to be bringing. Now I'm going to put them in those packing cubes. <laughs> My clothes are all nicely organized and I just need to put in a pair of shoes. I almost forgot that I was vlogging, so um, it is 8 right now. I'm running a bit late, but I'm going to take the bus to school because we have practice at 8 to 10 p.m. And today we're going over a bunch of dances, like almost all of the dances that we learned so far, which is going to be rough because it's definitely hard to memorize a new dance every week. <laughs> What's up guys? It is the next day. Great things are gonna happen today. I went to my 8 a.m. class, which I'm proud of myself because today is Friday, the last day before spring break. So I went to that. Then I went to my internship from 9.30 to 12.30 or 12. Then I went to my other class. Now I'm at the gym, going to do a full body workout. I look so sweaty but anyway I'm back at my apartment finished my workout while I was working out I got a notification that my flight was delayed by about an hour and I was just looking to see how much it would cost to lift I've lifted there before and usually it's around $20 they are charging $56.90 right now if you did a regular lift it would cost $87 it is 6.51 and my flight first got delayed. I don't know if I told you all that. It was delayed. And then I got a message an hour or two later saying that it was canceled. So I had to rebook it. There were only two time options available from Oakland Airport. There were no options for San Francisco airport and there were only options for tomorrow everything else for today was sold out i don't know why it was canceled they didn't say but i have a flight tomorrow now at 5 20 a.m so i'm gonna be leaving here at 3 30 a.m i'm gonna be getting my day started very early tomorrow i think i will be okay because when i go places that i actually want to go to it's easier to wake up I am going to say goodnight now. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Great things are going to happen tomorrow. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!